Right, we're using the Fitzbrick Dory blocks. Um, first I've had a chance to use them, and I like them. Um, uh, sorry. No, sorry. You just lay into there, and it's like laying in a hard profile. Now you know anyone who uses these blades, when you use these clips, there's, there's two problems with them. That the line has to go over the other line. It's never bothered me. It's, it's a couple of mil in it, isn't there? But it bothers some people. Um, with this, the line stays the same, same height all the time. And, you know, whenever you finish with a profile, you always put your level up it and check it, don't you? And I find it, even myself, with these blades, when you use end clips, there's always one brick, even though you like that line, they always seem to move. The same one you've got to tap in, or two or three you might have to tap in. Now, the idea of this is that you're just laying to a, a hard surface, so it shouldn't have to happen. So we'll build it, um, put the level up it, and we'll see. Yeah, have a look at this. I'll go along with that. Hold it on there. there you go, Fitz Brick Dory Block. Highly recommend it, I really do. It's a fantastic bit of kit, it really is. Um, I'm surprised, better than I thought it was going to be. Um, yeah, Brickland Tools got Tom. Com, bricklanetools.com have a look on there I don't know how much they are but um, yeah if you use blakes yeah you gotta have them I think yep